So a very good afternoon to all of you. It's a post-lunch session, so uh, Kesaji has been thankful to put me into the center of this dais, so I don't sleep. And uh, I have two brilliant speakers who are not going to make you sleep. Uh, the first part of this presentation was actually done in the morning, in the first session. So it's the second part of the trilogy. There is one more session post this after the tea break. So this is the remarkable story of uh, BRFL turnaround which they have done in Bangalore. Uh, so um, just before getting into the real story, <coughs> uh, change is something which was constantly referred in the first session. So um, change, I have a board in my room when you uh, get inside my uh, office which has been there for the last four years somewhere in 2010 I wrote it with a permanent marker uh, saying that change is the only constant one of the speakers earlier has actually said that here so if you are actually having a huge team and you want your team to understand one thing your boss or your, you as their manager want to actually listen to and your philosophy of life or your philosophy of work, it is better to have it prominently displayed in your room. Because every time I go inside my boss's cabin, I normally look at what he likes and what he doesn't like, what he keeps in his room, what mementos he has, does he have the picture of his wife, kids. And I try to take my conversations into subjects with my boss likes. Normally the boss is so smart that he normally tells me back something which I don't like and then we even it out but that one sentence was there for four years in my room and everybody in Madura who walked into my room knows that change is something which they will have to face day in and day out and as their leader I have to tell them that this is something which we have wiped it clean again after two months earlier because we have come out with a new vision so as um, Surendra so was speaking about the change and the kind of work they have actually putting in that first unit of BRFL of 500 missions. I was amazed by the way that companies which probably are really known, not known, for their effort initiatives in progress and BRFL has not been one of the great names you got associated with when you are working in Bangalore because there are a lot of things which actually worked against them and you see an effort that organization which is such a huge organization because they are suppliers to us they supply fabric to us and we see that huge strides that company is making it is remarkable how each of these challenges each of these factories and each of these organizations are taking there is not a one-stop solution to anything yesterday um, uh, Akshay was graceful enough to call us to Radnik we were in Radnik uh, we walked through Radnik and we we actually learned a lot of things the rigor of you know service here so uh, we we understood the rigor which the factories of Delhi actually put in pre-planning how solid we came to see the implementation of one of the technology solutions which came here and we saw that the sheer strength what probably the North, uh, North industry is actually putting to address style changes and the sheer effort and waste of uh, a style change which actually how it is getting addressed so it's a huge learning forum I'm thankful for uh, Radhnik uh, to actually call us and give us an opportunity to see that plant um, so as we deal with the volatility of the environment the uncertainty which we face the complexity of our business and finally the clear ambiguity of what to do next what are the next steps when you have case studies which actually goes through three sessions which clearly in the first session what uh, Surendra has told is how they went through the NDA project so he gave a synopsis of what is going to come in the second half and then the sheer way it is planned and I do believe the success of any intervention lies a lot and lot in planning the time you spent before you really start the work and this is that session and uh, I would invite my two friends from Wazir uh, Surinder as well as Bhavesh to take us through that journey and I am sure that you will find your own small uh, tips tricks 
and probably even worthy solutions which you can customize into your own units so i would still end up my very short uh, opening saying that change is the only constant we all will face it depends on how big it is going to be it depends on how our responses and how we plan and execute that so over to you and we are all your very avid listeners <laughs> <laughs>